It's getting chilly outside. It's going to feel good to snuggle in blankets, light some fire, drink something warm, and sit back and enjoy the beautiful, beautiful colors of autumn and winter. And I like bringing that inside. So I'm going to do a very, very low cost, almost no cost, little makeover on my living room to add the cozy. How to do that on a budget? That's a good question. Our colors in spring and summer tend to be lighter. Our fabrics tend to be lighter. And our, um, my design is pared down. There's less layering. So to bring in the warmth and the coziness, there's really three things that you concentrate on. Saturated color, layers, and texture. These are the ways to add in warmth and snuggliness without adding in a lot of heaviness. So I'm taking off the light silky sheets that are on the couch that act as the covers through the spring and summer and adding in beautiful chenille blankets that have the um, faux sheepskin on the back and they're very cuddly. I'm adding in um, hand knit items that have texture and warm color. Pillowcases go from cotton and uh, linen to velvets, velours, and layering becomes key to creating a space that has depth. So for example, on the top of this old Vantique stereo, I will add in one of my um, silk pashminas that has the colors that I love. I think that might be a really good place to help help you get started is figure out your color palette first. Mine tends towards very natural colors and I like um, green and adobe or aqua and adobe. I think terracotta and golds, brasses and bronzes, um, black with just hints of a bright green is a great palette for my cozy. So on the top of this old stereo, I'm going to layer on a silk pashmina and some plants in varying heights. And then I'm going to have here my adorable terracotta piggies that make me smile every single time I look at them. And then uh, maybe a little texture here in this stone that I brought from the, the beach of Mexico, or one of Mexico's best beaches, if you ask me. And, um, and my house hippo. This is a great way to layer on warmth without it feeling heavy. Don't overlook small elements that can make big impact. Two of the trays that I use to um, corral stuff and stage stuff went from being very light. One was wicker, one was a light wood with a glass insert, and those became dark and grounded. The uh, ottoman tray is an old Russian tray that is black, gold, and red, and the um, tray that is on the um, my bar cart, quote unquote, is kind of a black, kind of a, actually a espresso brown crocodile. So I'm looking at a lot of texture and a lot of deep saturated grounded color, but no shine, no um, nothing that reflects a lot of light back and says, hi, I'm light and bright and airy. So don't overlook what a very small element in a room can do by adding that deep grounded color for your for your winter effect. And then of course the final element is going to be light whether it's firelight or uh, incandescent light. I want light that has that warm golden feel to it. 